Alright, Mark signed in and we're back on Cyberpunk 2077 again. Um, now I've just jumped straight from one video to the other but I've tried messing around with OBS to try and get it so my game runs smoother. It's... I, I can't, I need I need another system to be honest um, to get it running smoothly. I can't do it all on my computer because it's not really the most powerful to be honest. But yeah, um, we won't waste any more time. I'll probably end up doing one main mission in this video as well. But yeah, um, if you enjoyed this video give it a like, feel free to drop a comment down below and let's click back on the game. <laughs> and uh, yeah, if you want to see more of my videos, just give me a sub. Just make sure you uh, ding the little bell so you actually get notified when I do upload more content. All right, and let's switch over to my gameplay scene and let's game on. All right, I'm not sure if that's. Hold on. What mission do I have? See, that's the main mission. Um, I, do you know what? Let's do a couple of fights. Uh, which is be on the brat. What's this psycho killer? Oh yeah, of course, yeah, I need to find them, but... Oh well. Let's do this first fight. Animals Club. Yeah, I do need, I do need to... Oh, actually, you know what? Let me just have a look at uh, what have I got for uh, see I've got one attribute upgrade. Let's upgrade my body. Um and then what we got here. What's a uh, hard motherfucker? <laughs> you know what? I want to get this health for one and then try and work towards this here. Oh no, look, this street brawl, I should have got something from here. I forgot they have them different. Um, oh well. There's so, whoa, so many perks and stuff. Oh, I could have gone that way. Let's just do it. Let's just go this way. See, the frame rate's not too bad, really. It's playable. It's just knowing that I can get more out of it when I've not got ABS open. It's just it's depressing. <laughs> Squeeze through there, nice. There's a main mission there. Whoa. Turn sharp, this bike does. Whoop, whoop, whoop. <laughs> Save yourselves. Go to the animals club. I think I've already come across one of the animals so far, I'm not sure. But I'm guessing we're gonna see quite a few of them here. And I'm pretty sure they're like top brawlers, pensadine animals. Like they're built for fighting. Still got quite a ways to go to be honest. Hopefully not too far. Frame rate's down to 25. Ugh. As long as I can get where I'm going, it's fine. I guess it's it's not as bad as watchdogs to be fair. So I can get some pretty poor frame rates out of that while I'm driving around. Oh look, it's gone up to 40. The question mark on the map. Entering a new area, the Glen. Oh, who's this? Since we're gonna work together, only right to say hello. They call me El Capitan, and they call you me. See, no introductions necessary. I already took care of that. Someone comes to me with beers, I take care of it. I eat, <laughs> sleep, and breathe beers. Remember that. Is he based on Scarface? While we're at it, you need fresh wheels, bikes, I got it all. Nice. Real good prices. So hit me up anytime, you're here. I'll have to see what he's got, because I do need a vehicle of my own. 
Going through the middle here. Yeah. That thing put me off there, didn't mind something. Let's have a look. <laughs> See, I'm not sure if I'm, I might get some vehicles from doing uh, the story, to be honest. Right, here we go. The fight's down here. Hold it, word. You think you could just get in for free? Let me guess, I got a wager, yeah? What is this place? If you don't know, then you sure as hell don't belong. Eh. Uh, instead of wasting money. Out of my fucking way. <laughs> what? You think you're some kind of hot shit you can get in anyway? Yeah. Nothing to think about. I know it. So step the fuck aside. <laughs> I'm gonna have to fight him, right. fucking. Fucking go. Oh, nice. So having my perk or attribute or whatever up at seven got me in for free. Come on! What the then consider yourself dead. What the fuck you are. Hey, you look familiar. You're from Watson, right? Didn't your old oh, man? Gosh, she looks destroyed. Garage? Yeah. For they tossed him in the joint. Right. I remember. Badges caught him clepping watches. Among other things. Peeps dying on the streets like flies, and all they cared about were stolen hubcaps. Fucking narcs. Anyway, you wanted something? Yeah. Uh. This is a fight club, right? <coughs> for animals. Used to be a factory for manufacturing paints or some shit. Putting some equipment. Slap a ring in the middle, got yourself a kennel. Here for a fight. You? Interesting. <laughs> Why interesting? Because these guys are huge. Wondering if I'll recognize you after. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, is that it? Alright, let's go. Well, who's next? Anyone else? Got to fight. Rhino. Like that's so. Don't look familiar to me. You fresh meat here? Could say that. Well, watch yourself then. They don't like strangers here. One wrong look, and you're crawling through the gutter on busted legs. Sounds like an augmented voice, well, I suppose. You defeat me. Oh, that's what I'm fighting. I vouch for you to the right folks. You could use the equipment, meet with the trainer, that kind of stuff. Oh, sad. Uh, thanks. Appreciate it. I'd say you're welcome. But there's still the matter of defeating me. And full disclosure, I've never lost a fight. Great. We not throwing any eddies on this match? No. When the cash comes in, it just muddles the whole sport. <laughs> I'm here for fights, and the fights alone. Say, who's running this club? Sasquatch. His name's Logan uh. Garcia. Used to be the best damn boxer in Night City. Who knows? Maybe in all the states. Not overselling it a bit there. Just watch him in action. You'll see. <laughs> you see, right, you lost. I say there's a first time for everything. Ha! Sorry to say, you'll be disappointed. Come on. <laughs> Let's go. I'm gonna get hammered. <laughs> I think I'm gonna. I'm just gonna have to watch the punches. Got any good tech under the hood? Sensory filters, rotors, boosted core. You're about to find out. Ah! True, oh my gosh! True. I'm actually scared right, right now. Then. Shall we? Oh no. Let's get to it. Good luck. You'll need it. <gasps> Yo! Oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm gonna get done. I oh, am yeah, gonna get done. I won! Jesus. I won! <laughs> How was I supposed to beat that? <laughs> yes.
Let's get to it. Oh my god. Good gosh. luck. You'll need it. <sighs> Jesus. I won. I won. I won. Yeah, I noticed. Oh my gosh. Seeing as we're already warmed up, you want a rematch. There's actually no point in me blocking. All right, I'm going to try this one more time. Let's get to it. Good luck. You'll need it. Oh, I'm just going to have to keep dodging. Oh my god. I won. I won. I won. <sighs> yeah, I noticed. Right, I'm not doing that again. We're already warmed up. You want a rematch? I need to level up my character somehow. That is just insane. Hey, give me a bit. I'll be back soon. Sure. Just careful around the club, cause you know. What's she sitting on? <laughs> oh my gosh. What was that on the floor? Yep, can't do that. That is insane. Right, let's have a look. Uh, journal. Yeah, it does say danger very high. What's this one? Oh, wait, hold on. Yeah, let's do that. Pay the man what he's due. I can't believe that. That's insane. Two punches. That's crazy though to think that you can actually level up your character enough to, to beat that. Whoa, what the heck? I don't know what I was doing there. How do I get out of here now? Crack the wall. <laughs> Let's go. We have done some serious damage to the bite now as well. Ooh. See them skills. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Let's see how it handles in third person. bit easier maybe this is n54 news with a breaking story a cyber psycho attack shocks wellsprings lester mc what's going on there age 28 fire at the river mall shopping center the shooting lasted 10 minutes am i supposed to go near Talk to them. Yeah, I guess so. What am I supposed to do with these? I don't get it. Like, what is that? Is it just a warning saying that they're there? I think it, I think it's just telling me that they're there. To be honest. Right, let's go. My bike don't look too damaged, to be fair. Watch my bike, man. Alright, let's see what's cracking off here. There's two guys in here. Doing no damage. It's doing nothing. They're coming for me. Go 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 go. Get on. Go. <laughs> yeah, I really. I mean, I need to start learning the, the, the power of the enemies in this. I'm evidently extremely weak so far. Okay, 
Let's go down the footpath. I know they were saying this map is like supposed to be small, but it just feels massive. It really does. Our frame rate's not too bad at the moment, actually. I think when I get to these speeds, it seems to um, seems to start seems to smooth out a bit. Oh. This time I'm going to analyse the. Um... Oh, it's underneath the bridge. No, I can't bother with that. They've actually jammed this game full of stuff to do. It's crazy. Yeah, I need to. I need to upgrade Brawler. I don't think it is the bike making that sound because it's doing it at different speeds. Red area for. Nice right, park wheel. I'm not sure if I can get. Can we get this way? Let's have a look. Nope. Don't make me mad. Shut up. Well, that was stupid, wasn't it? Why would you do that? Why would you stand underneath my bike? Invisible wall. Do you truly believe that those who have sold you your mechanical eyes have resisted the temptation to peek through them? Cameras are all around us, even within us. Your joys, your worries, your life. For them, it is all mere spectacle. <laughs> I should trip them out. Hmm. Ever since Vic stole my Karoshi eyes, <clears throat> I had this feeling that someone's watching. Cybernetics are our undoing, a blessing and a curse. We replace our flesh most sacred with metal, their metal. They hold the off switch, our sight, our breath, even our minds, theirs for the taking. But who are those who follow okay. every step, you ask? Why the titans of entertainment in Alpha Centauri? In their wretchedness, they placate their weary. I'm sure I've got What the Yeah, I'm sure I've got enough to pay him off now. Oh no, twenty-one thousand. Oh that was a waste of my time. Uh what else we got? for the car to be repaired. Uh, what's this one? Yeah, let's give her a call. V, good to hear you. Finally. Been a long time since we talk. Since when Jackie passed away. How are you doing? 
How you think? What is life without my son is dead. But I am hanging in there. Calling to offer my condolences. Mm. Offer your condolences. Ay, Jesus Cristo, v. You lived under our roof. Have the decency not to treat me like some stranger you just met. <laughs> I was going to call you. I prepared an ofrenda for Jaquito. We can't let him go without a proper goodbye. The ceremony will be at the Coyote Cojo. Many of his friends will be there. I'll be there too. Say no more, Mama Wells. I'll be there. I did not doubt it for a second. Ahí te veo, B. Alright, let's go. Wish you people just wouldn't be in the way. Oh shit, someone saw me. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Get out of the area. What? Oh, there's another street fight going on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, I just squeezed through. Verticality of this city, like how high all the buildings are and everything. Really does feel like. Do you know what? There's there's not there's not many games that I'll play right, and then like I'll I'll see so I'll see the gameplay for them in trailers and stuff, and I get like a like a, an idea of how it would feel to be in the games, and then about my car's fixed look. You are currently at the exact location where I lost contact with the car. Fine, I'll have a look around. So, hold on. Wait, do I need to look at the map? So this is around here. How do I find it? Yeah, I've got no clue how that works. <coughs> Wait, why is it telling me to go back? It told me to come down this way. There we go, it's adjusted again. Oh, come on out of my way. move yeah I like I think this is like one of the f few if not the first game that I've seen got a feeling about like how it feel to actually play it and it's yeah it's, it's exactly how I thought it would be ah it's around here currently at the exact location where I lost contact with the car fine I'll have a look around Approach the dummy cap. That's what it switched. It switched my um. Oh. Seems a bit far away. Oh. I don't know how I didn't get smashed off there. Still moving. 
Look, it's gone this way. Oh, shut up. There it is. Hey, let's talk. <laughs> what? Try to take me and I'll crush you. What the heck? Let's see who crushes who. Oh my gosh. Ugh. That made me jump, that did. So I need to damage it. Wait. Oh, crap. I've got the police after me, I've got a car after me, I've got this gang after me. Right, maybe if I can... Oh my gosh. There we go. Let's get out of this area. How fortunate. I've relinked to the vehicle. Thank you. Weird. Your fee is in your account. Nice. How much? How much did you give me? Stand here. The sun is down. Right. So I need to go to... Where was it? It was... Uh... Where is it? No, they're, they're all the heroes. There we go, track job. I've got, new, got some new stuff here. Six armor. Yeah, I've already seen that. Already seen that. And already seen that. Uh, I'm sure I got. Yes, I got. Oh, shotgun. Swap that out for that one. Any assault rifles. That's not that much more powerful, to be honest. Keep it as it is. Is there any upgrades I can throw on? Right, yeah. Right, so I need to upgrade body. And then street brawler. Right, what we got? This is all about blunt weapons. What about Annihilation? No. Yeah, it's got to be this one. I might as well just get that because I know that's going to be helpful, to be honest. I do need to start leveling up some of the other stuff, to be honest. I hope you're still up. Right. Let's go this way. To find the answer, check out the latest book from Richard Sanchez titled Chromo Sapiens. Sapiens. In a nutshell, according to Sanchez, humankind can never be fully automated. Um, street cred's gone up. New gigs available. Damn brain chemistry. I wonder if this bestseller has made the Maelstrom Book Club's reading list. What? Do what you set out to do. The next time, they will be expecting you. Like that. Okay. I'm not sure what that was for. I can't remember what I did, to be honest. Oh, nearly there. 
it's only round the corner ish. Oh, 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 oh. I'm not sure when I'll need a new vehicle to be honest. I've smashed this around a bit, but it doesn't seem to care. It's, it's almost that amazing. Look around the area. I lost contact with the Delamay network vehicle nearby. Look okay. Do you want me to get a, another car chasing me down to just try and squash me? The annoying thing is I can't even shoot while I'm riding. Alright, let's head in. The pool table? We got to get rid of it. There we go. Really? It's pretty massive. The nice to see you. Okay, sit. Sit. You want a beer? Wouldn't mind one. Salud. A lot of time has passed. How you been? Been better to tell you the truth. What is happening? That night, when Jackie fell. I should say things haven't exactly been easy since. Yo sé cómo te sientes. Todos lo sabemos. I am in the middle of preparing an ofrenda. There is still so much to take care of. You can actually see Jackie's face in her face. I know what an ofrenda is, but... An ofrenda? What's that exactly? We gather to celebrate the departed, our memories of them, and we bring things they loved in life and might need in the after. Only because I watch Coco. The beard be at the top of Jackie's list. <laughs> and there will be beer. Could help you with that. Gracias, mi cielo. But I will manage. It's enough you come to say goodbye. <laughs> Want to take part in this <clears throat> thing, but want to do it the right way, in line with tradition. Mm -hmm. But something I'd lay by his casket, that would do justice to his memory, I, I don't got anything. Mm. But your heart is in the right place, mi niño. Don't worry, he's symbolic. Look for something in his garage. His past is all there. Jackie had a garage? He used it for his motorcycle, mostly. But not so long ago he moved in. You'll find something there, I'm sure. You won't mind me digging through his stuff? No, mijo. He's gone, and funerals are for the living, not the dead. Toma, take the key. Thanks, Mama Wells. Ah, don't mention it, Lee. You have respect. I admire that. The garage is on Republic. I de veo. Oh, that's any of real. Just left the bike out front, and then if I'll be able to get it again. Should be able to. Can't imagine it would despawn since I've used it. Hi. Is that yeah. You're here alone? This is not exactly the safest neighborhood in town, Misty. I used to sit on the stairs when I was 10. 26 now. If anything was gonna happen, it wouldn't have taken this long. What are you doing here? Sitting and waiting. And yeah, waiting for him. Though I know he's never coming back. Lately, I've just been coming here to sit. An hour. Sometimes two. I know it's gonk, it's just... I miss him. A lot. Wanna sit? Catch up? Hardly gonk at all. Just, well, human. I guess. You know each other long. <laughs> Half our lives. Grew up in the same <laughs> streets. Saw each other a lot, but just never got together. Till a year back. 
Yeah. Best darn year of my life. Jack talked about you a lot. Always saying how much you meant to him. Did he really say that? I bet he used different words. Maybe. But that's what he meant. I really believe that. You actually got to know him. The real Jackie. Everybody else thought he was a goofball with a rough-hewn face and an edge. <laughs> but they're wrong. What did you see in him? Let me tell you what he told me once. He told me he'd take a bullet for me. In an instant. Even if it'd kill him. Spoken like a true Haywood boy. A man. With dreams. Ambitions. Only thing they cost him was his life. There's a huge chunk of his past in there. How come you're outside? I don't have the key. Jackie never gave you a set. What, you, you two didn't get that far? He offered, but I wanted him to have his own space. Just his own. Mama Wells is having a send-off for Jackie. We need to find something he really cared about. You mind giving me a hand? I'm not sure I should go in there, V. Still too soon? No, it's not that. Mama Wells and huh. I aren't exactly on what the best that? terms. She wouldn't want me touching any of his things, disturbing the memory. That I know. Jackie would want you here. That's more important. Come on. Fine piece of metal in mechanics. He was so psyched. Love to poke around engines. He was 15 when he first got on a bike. Knowing him, it's a miracle he never wiped out. <laughs> For whom the bell tolls, Ernest Hemingway. Jack read it a dozen times, always right before a big job. He said the guy who wrote it was tougher than Morgan Blackhand. Have you read it? Is it any good? I... I never got the chance. It'd be a good tribute for the Ofrenda, though. What's this? Jackie's room. Still full. His favorite. Strategic reserve. No touching. <laughs> How come? ¿Por qué no puedes tocar una reserva estratégica, va? <laughs> oh, Jackie. That a mandala? Mm -hmm. oh, it's a long story. Hey, you all right? I'm so much better than all right. I once told Jackie he should sweep all the dark energy out of this place. A sand mandala would do the trick, for example. He told me that out of sand he'd build a castle, a home, the Wells family hideout, stronghold, something. I guess you made a bigger impression than you thought. I guess I did. It's beautiful. It's hideous. But it's also the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Looks like it didn't get finished. Alright, let's scan the garage. Guess no man cave's complete without some of those, huh? He said they're collectibles. Oh, yeah. <laughs> they don't print them anymore. That's definitely why they're up there. Yeah. <laughs> What 
says. Basketball, Basketball. signed by Dante Gonzalez. <clears throat> he was from Haywood, too. Everyone here shot hoops. Dante ran circles around him. I think he might have been the first kid to ditch the Valentinos. Like Jackie. Mm hmm. They both wanted more out of life. Dante's captain of the NC Blackouts now. What else is there? Jackie Obviously. loved the pump iron, <laughs> didn't he? He called it his form of meditation. He used to say barbells are the best listeners. They understand all your problems and never give you gonk advice. Gotta be hanging here since 2020. What else is here? I've gone through all this stuff. Let's go through here. An aquarium. It used to be tacos. And taco was... Miss Fish. A dwarf shark. Like, Minnie. Sounds like a mighty expensive fish. <laughs> oh, I don't think he bought it. Jackie's favorite tequila. Oh, still sealed. It's his lucky charm. One of the first bottles ever made by Jesus de Abajo. What? The founder of Sanson Tequila. Only a hundred of them left in the world. All owned by the one percent. Well, how'd Jackie get this one? Some shriveled abuela in Mexico sold it to him. Told him de Abajo had stolen her recipe. Nice still. Is that her? Yeah, it is. It's gotta be Jackie's dad. Old school ganger. Valentino's, of course. Did you meet him? No, I only ever heard about him. But he didn't exactly inspire many fond memories. Mm, probably not the best to choose then. Leather belt. Sort of a memento. His dad's. He used to beat both Jackie and his mom with it. Until one day, Jackie fought back. Kicked his butt. Told him he'd kill him next time. Old man was hospitalized, and then he left. Why'd he hold on to it? In case his dad ever comes back. I think... Uh, what are we gonna go with? Maybe this book. Jack. Pure and simple. Well, you got something for your ofrenda. But we could look around a little more. Nice out, Doug. Got everything. Set out. Better get going. Actually, V, I think I'll stay a while. Say bye to him here. Mama Wells wouldn't want me there anyway. What happened between you two? What's the beef? Let's just say she didn't see me as daughter-in-law material. What'd she have against you? That my name wasn't Camila and I wasn't Jackie's ex-output. Camila was Mama Wells' favorite. Right. You gotta come, Misty. You got a right to be there. I'd rather not get in Mama Wells' way. It's for family. You were family to him. I guess you're right. Thanks, V. <clears throat> so, shall we go? You ever thought you might leave Night City? Sure. Once upon a time, I even tried. Seriously? You mean in... That, I'll see you at the Coyote... What? Oh, was that? Okay. After a week, I realized I couldn't live without the traffic outside my window and my neighbors hollering. What mission's that? It says there's something behind me, but no idea what that is. My deepest condolences. He was a fat boy. <laughs> what? Do you say he's a fat boy? A <laughs> Good you're here. We're about to start. 
Sit down, please. Hey, V. I thank you all for coming today. I'm not going to tell you what kind of man my son was or lament about how much I miss him. Instead, I'll tell you a story. When he was about 19 years old, Jackie was in the Valentinos. They were at war with Maelstrom back then. I get a call from the hospital. They tell me he got shot three times, just by the heart. He was conscious when I get there. So many tubes coming out of him. He looked like a, like a pulpo, like an octopus or something. He tell me, he said, No te preocupes, mama. I'm bulletproof. Nothing bad will ever happen to me. <laughs> and when I go, he take off his Valentino's ring. He swear he won't need it anymore. But he was not scared. He just didn't want me to worry. <laughs> Descansa en paz, mi hijo. Among the membership of the Night City Devils Boxing Club, we had this saying, make your best friends among the fighters who knock you out cold. And it's true, Jackie's arm <laughs> was a cannon. No one's ever hit me as hard. <laughs> I can still almost feel it. Porta. Lamenta no estar aquí. Todavía le quedan cuatro años que cumplir. Me pidió que leyera esto. Recuerdo cuando Jackie se nos unió. Era un niño fuerte. Cuando decía que iba a hacer algo, cumplía. Tenía olor, ol, ol, honor. Podría haber llegado lejos. Bless me, struggling to Mis read. Condolencias a la familia. Que descanse en paz. Anyone else? I, uh, I often think back to the first time me and Jack met. It all started when he put a heater to my head. <laughs> then some badges showed up and beat the shit out of us both. It's half my fault, half his. We hightailed it out together. Half an hour later, well, we're eating dinner at Mama Wells. Turned out to have more in common than we thought. Principles. Jackie Wells. Best friend you could ask for. Loyal to a fault. Once he set his mind to something, he was ready to die to achieve it. He once told me, Bro, there. One thing we can't do is be afraid of others. For his loved ones, he'd sacrifice his life without hesitation. But most importantly, Jackie loved life and had no fear hard on his sleeve. He didn't overthink things. He just went for it. Thought he was bulletproof. And, and that he'd become legend at the afterlife. And ultimately, he did what he set out to do. <coughs> Shit in the shoes of some powerful people. <laughs> and if he's watching, I bet just about now, he's flipping them all the bird. When you go to war as a boy, 
you have a great illusion of immortality. Other people get killed, not you. Then, when you are badly wounded the first time, you lose that illusion. Rest easy, Chu. I would like to say a toast. Or mi hijo. Thank you for your kind words, V. I'm glad you're here. It was a beautiful ofrenda we gave him. A lot of people come today. Even that putica Jackie was messing around with. <laughs> Her name is Misty. What? Misty. And she was very important to him. Do you understand? Go. Invite her along for dinner. It's the least she deserves. You know what? You're a good man. Jackie would want you to have these. I'm sorry. You... You sure? Jackie would kill me if I got so much as a scratch on it. Oh, the bike. So don't get any scratches on it. <laughs> Thank you. I'll take such good care of it. Cuídate, V. Uh, where's Vic? Where is he? La calle B, la calle juzga. La calle nunca olvida. Hey, are you all right? Yeah, I think I'm just still in that garage mentally. I just need a sec. Oh, that's Vic. Campos all torn up. Says he feels like he lost one of his I'm own. gonna miss him. I wonder if he'll be as torn up after you. Already do. Oh, chingado. <laughs> Me today. too, cabron. Not today. Me too. Here's to Jackie. Got off to greener pastures. Jackie Wells. <laughs> A proud son of Haywood. Well, uh, I should mingle, Vic. Sure. See you later, V. Pour you another? For Jaquito? You see, the Valentinos haven't forgotten about Jackie. Days like this, even the meanest motherfuckers pay their <laughs> respects. Principles. Jackie lived by them. They's what kept them going. Weird being here without Jackie. Can't shake the feeling I'm gonna turn around and see him sitting at the bar. In his favorite spot, where he always used to sit. Poor. For Jackie. Amen, brother. Hey, you! Have a drink with us, hmm? To Wells? All right, why not? To Wells! May he rest in peace. How'd you meet Jackie? We started out together. In the Valentinos? No, in the fucking Bible Book Club. Yeah. I got only good memories of him. Rest easy up there, brother. Good for now, thanks. See? You gotta know when to stop. <laughs> All right, give me a break. All right, let's go. Lupe's been handling the loss pretty good. She's a strong woman. Where's the stairs? I'm guessing. 
There we go. You uh, here to say goodbye to one of your own, Padre? I'm here to say goodbye to a good man. So, Padre, you think Jackie's looking down upon us from up there? I believe he has met God and stood before him. That's it. I don't know if God left the meeting happy, but I'm pretty certain Jackie did. <laughs> Jackie, uh, do you know him well? I remember the day his mother brought him into this world. The day his father left. The day he took you into his home. Yes, V. I knew him quite well. How were things in the streets? This is not the place to conduct business. <laughs> Have some respect. I'm gonna move on. Go with God. Right. Leave the bar. Another mission done. Uh, what else we got? Oh, yeah. There we go. Journal. In fact, have I got any, um, got any messages that I've missed? Yeah. What's this? Alright. Gig type. Gun for hire. Neutralize. Jose Luis. Uh, location. Bus depot on Benko Street. Uh, details. A few weeks ago, a police officer was shot dead. Some Same old story, some Valentino kids got into a scrap with the badges. The fatal pe piece of lead was shot by a gang, ganger named Jose Luis. The investigation was dropped and officers from the local precinct were told to back off. Pretty interesting turn, turn of events, wouldn't you say? Uh, Jose must have had some friends in high places. Here's the deal. One of the officers wants Jose to be brought to justice which is where you come in. If you happen to find out who's protecting Val the Valentino, I'll throw in extra good luck. Gigs. Gun for hire, there it is. Boss Depot. All right, let's go grab this one. How far is it? 800 meters, not even that far. Oh wait, hold on. Um. Yeah, there we go. Call up Jackie's bike. What the? <laughs> Wait, is that my busted up car? Which is now fixed. Okay. Well, we'll take Jackie's bike anyway. <laughs> that was so random. Let's go. See, at least I can call this in there. Nice turn. What's going on down here? Some up here. Another of God's wayward daughters is long due for judgment. I need someone who can hasten her journey to stand before the Lord. Details attached. Alright, what was the question mark? Gone for hire. Uh, a girl died a while back in the Glen. Her name was Rosita. I knew her. 17 years old. Picture perfect smile. Got hit by a car while she was crossing the road. I saw the CCTV. Almost tore her legs clean off. If she'd gotten to the emergency room sooner, she might have lived. Who knows? But it was the middle of the night. Empty street. Driver fled the scene. Soon enough, the NCPD found our culprit. The lady's name, Tucker Alback. Uh, Vice managing director of something at Kuroshi. Her insurance covered vehicular 
uh, manslaughter. So as far as the NCPD is concerned, she's off the hook. Only punishment she got is her insurance raising her premium. Jesus, hardly a slap on the wrist. Over my dead body. This isn't what justice is supposed to look like. Eye for an eye, tooth for a tooth, hand for a hand, wound for a wound. Rosita once took a gun, and this is... And you're going to pull the trigger. Okay. Well, so that's on the list. All right, where's this? Uh, there's a question mark here. Is this, can I see it from here? Oh, that's what that question mark is. Oh, it's that mission. Okay, okay. Well, I've already got one on track anyway, so we'll go do this. Oh yeah, I know there's something to do with crafting as well in this actually. Let me have a quick look at that. What is uh I know I want to start a look at this. Crafting. Right. Uh, okay. Oh, that's pretty sick that is. so I can just pick a weapon and it'll I can I can craft it. So hold on. Are these just weapons I've picked up before? That's the one I bought into it. So if I craft this, it doesn't even take many. And if I go to my inventory. There it is, sniper rifle. It's not as powerful as the shotgun though, but there we go. That's how it's done. That's pretty sick. I wonder how you get more blueprint. Oh, you must be able. Yeah, I bought that last blueprint, so I guess I've got another turn on the left here, somewhere down here. There it is. One person on their own. They're right there. Hold on. What's he doing? Wow. That was creepy. I'm trying to not stand there like that. Jesus, go away, man. Well, hi there. Johnny Silverhand ripoff. Oh, great, there's more people. He can see me. So does this mean I can see? Yeah, that's how it works. Okay, so now I can see everyone. Ping, ping. So handy. Come on.
I might just do this, you know. Wait, I need to see how powerful they are, actually. What does it say about, um... I've got one level up here. Let's just increase the damage. Oh yeah. Uh, journal. Gigs. Very high. Great. So no way I can distract him. camera caught me oh yeah I really need to look at the missions that I'm trying to do yeah the annoying thing is is the fact that like I'm so underpowered at the moment right journal What's this one? Can't pay off that yet. Uh, can I go to this one? No. Uh, we've got moderate. All right, let's try talking to Barry again. Actually, you know what? Let's do a main mission. Oops, didn't track it. It's a little bit closer as well, that one. I think it might have been a, a bug that my car showed up because I don't think it was supposed to because it still says wait for, on that one mission, it still says wait for car to be fixed or repaired or whatever. Oh, whoa, whoa. There we go. Let's fit through there. Last time I saw your face, it had my fist planted in it. Ah, you know what's past is past. What's more important is the sweet gig I got you. Quick and easy buck. Swing by the coyote and I'll tell you. First round's on me. Well, what do you say? Yeah, go on now. Fine. See you there. Same old B. I always said you were smart. You say a lot of things, Kirk. <laughs> You're bullshit included. Oh, no, V. Not this time. This time, everything's just like it's supposed to be. Best not stall too long on this one. Later. All right, let's do a main mission. When it says uh, best not stall too long, I guess you got to get as many of these side missions out of the way as possible before you like pretty much do get to a certain point in the main story. You do not look so bad. Then, in the car, I doubted that you would survive. Why'd you help me anyway? 
I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. This is about the biochip? Is that why I'm here? Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond the repair. Any attempt to extract, it would be disastrous. Fatal for you. Mm-hmm. Nick likes to talk, I guess. <coughs> Not many could do what he did. You should be thankful. What's it you actually want from me? To begin. I love the cybernetics on his neck. To find Evelyn Parker. Why would I do that? Evelyn. What's she to you? She and the Yorino Barasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. I'm thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Why you figure she skipped town? I tried to locate her, but had no success. I suspect she covered her truck. <coughs> you said Parker could help you remove the relic. Does she work for a corporation? Got no clue. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic and a large chunk of classified info. An enigma to be sure, but she showed that slyness he getting corpo agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out, lumped with the outcasts, easily. Or have you forgotten? Ooh. Sorry I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose, so... Hey, wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice. In Night City. <laughs> I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. What if I say no? Then I will tell you what rewards await if you help me. Go on, eh? So what? <coughs> Stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. <laughs> in that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. Very true. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. Exactly what kind of people are we talking about? People who hold Arasaka dear. Ah, it's hot. People interested in the corporation's stable growth. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prep for the heist. Thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true. He's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. <laughs> Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka. Betrayed it. What's going on here? Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you... Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey! I was listening to that! Mm. Shut up! Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? <laughs> you heard me. Let it go, Takamura. Hmm. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. 
Jesus. Tom's all right. Not afraid to speak his mind, that's all. He reminds me of my father. He also worked in a kitchen all his life. Last thing we want to do is to draw attention. I'm sorry. A stupid reflex. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. We'll get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. No, leave? Anyway. Why would I leave? <laughs> Need help. <coughs> Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. It's gonna have to be. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? <laughs> Dropped off the face of the earth. Somebody's been busy the last few days. I will not sit and do nothing when there is information to be found. Things to prepare. Your job, basically. It was my job. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place, the club called The Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the queen of fixers there, Rogue. Mean to say you worked for Saburo, yet got no idea how to talk to the High and Mighty. She wished to have nothing to do with the man accused of murdering Saburo Arasaka. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The old man is choosy, expensive, and rude. <laughs> Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my Wait, man. what? Haven't I just done that? And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so... Hellman defected from the... I myself... Why am I going through this again? Why are you looking... He was... Corporal rats will squeal. For several days. I was quick... Mean to say you worked for sub... She would... Why have I gone in a loop here? I wish you luck. Oh, I think I've tried to bump stay. I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she would not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes, <coughs> I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. Your noble Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. <laughs> That Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Helma, whoever. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm going to look for Helman, to be honest. Call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. No, he's taking his chip out first before you do anything. Whoa! Oh my gosh. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arsaka's still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. Leave me the fuck alone. 
You don't need to speak out loud to talk to me. <laughs> what do you want from me? Are you still upset about the other night? You tried to kill me. Well, I gave it some thought and changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Fuck off, you psychopath. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. Why should I trust you? Remind me again. Trust me, don't trust me. I don't give a fuck. It's the least of our worries, anyway. You're the ghost of Chris's past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? <laughs> Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. <laughs> Don't need convincing. Seeing your memories, gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. I'm guessing he's gone. Yeah. Okay. I think it's time to leave it there, to be honest. So I'm going to save it. Uh, save it on the right one so I don't overrun the other one. There we go. But yeah, that's it. Uh, I'm going to switch over to my cam zoom. But yeah, uh, I've got, I'm going to record one more video tomorrow for Friday. And uh, yeah, that's it. That's, uh, if you enjoyed that video, give it a like. Feel free to drop a comment down below. And if you want to see more of my videos, just uh, give me a sub. Just make sure you ding that little bell so you actually get notified when I do upload more content. And that's it. So I'll sign out. Cheers.